believe it or not, I'm making quite a grand effort to get this Hold Peak HP 846A anemometer into regular testing, into regular rotation for testing so I can eventually rotate out or keep as a backup my trusty GM 8901 anemometer that you see all over the place. So I wanted to do some fun testing with this Diamond Edition. Now I'll run it with this high-low switch in its highest speed, but I'm going to keep the brush roll spinning, and obviously that's in its standard brush roll spinning speed. You can take the head off and then use a screwdriver and pump this thing up to even higher exhaust CFM than what I'm running right here. But have you ever wondered exactly what the exhaust CFM and for that matter, say miles an hour or kilometers an hour of the exhaust airflow of this thing. Maybe it's higher than what you think. Maybe it's exactly what you think. So let's have a little fun with this and see what it does. And I'm going to run through several different screens so you can see what, uh, what this machine can actually do. So you'll notice a conversion factor up here at the top of the screen. And that's what I've settled on so far. I have done seven data points, a little less than 40 CFM and a little more than 100 CFM. And everything in there, like I said, seven data points. And I'm pretty confident in this conversion factor, but I might want to tweak it a little bit later on. I'll let you know if I need to make any changes. But this will be a good test of something that's well over 100 CFM. So let's see if we can have a little fun. Now see, what's so cool is I just push the power button right there. Boom, it comes up. Here's my conversion factor and CFM, and it's got four digits. Now, of course, nothing's running right now, so it should say zero, and it does. So let's see just how much airflow comes out of this exhaust port. And I'll run through several different units as well. Um, obviously, it's going to get a little loud. kind of fun. Let me show you a little different angle.
75 some odd miles an hour, 124, 25 kilometers an hour, and or say 175 to 180 CFM, that's a lot of wind. Thanks for watching.